Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to uh, express my sincere appreciation to you all for joining me today as we come together to address the concerns raised by the public regarding uh, recent incidents reports. As the Minister for Home Affairs and Immigration, it is my utmost priority to ensure the safety, security and well-being of all our Fijian citizens. Today I stand before you to share our comprehensive approach to those concerns and the proactive measures we are taking to address them effectively. First and foremost, I wholeheartedly recognize the concern expressed by the public. We understand that citizens rightfully expect their communities to be safe, to be safe havens, free from fear and from intimidation. Rest assured, we are deeply committed to building and maintaining safe and secure environments where individuals can thrive and lead fulfilling lives. One of the factors that have been brought to our attention is the current police to population ratio, which stands at one police constable for every 193 individuals. We acknowledge that this ratio is not sufficient to ensure optimal public safety and community well-being. Despite this, the police have been able to meet their KPIs for the last six months. However, I am pleased to inform you that the government has made a substantial investment to address these concerns. As part of our commitment to bolstering law enforcement resources, we are heavily investing to add 100 new police constables to our force. These additional personnel will play a vital role in increasing police presence and on the streets and enhancing our ability to respond to incidents promptly. By augmenting our police force, we aim to achieve a better police to population ratio, which will significantly contribute to the safety and security of all our Fijian communities. Furthermore, I am thrilled to announce that these new police constables will be trained in a comprehensive manner, equipping them with the necessary skills, knowledge to serve our communities effectively. This training will emphasize community engagement, de-escalation techniques and cultural sensitivity, ensuring that our police force not only maintains law and order, but also build strong relationships with the people that they serve. In addition to increasing police numbers, we are implementing the Police Beat Initiative, which I mentioned earlier. This program will further enhance police visibility and accessibility in our neighborhoods, fostering the sense of safety and reassurance for all our citizens. With the combined efforts of the new recruits and the Police Beat program, we are confident in our ability to address the concerns raised by the public and provide a safe environment for everyone. Now, accountability remains a cornerstone of our strategy. We firmly believe in transparency and the responsibility to maintain the trust placed in us by the public. As such, we are continuously reviewing and improving our systems, policies, and practices to ensure that our law enforcement agencies are held to the highest standards of professionalism, integrity, and of fairness. The public deserves to know that their concerns are taken seriously and we are actively working to address them. Nevertheless, we cannot achieve public safety alone. We recognize the importance of community involvement. We recognize the importance of community involvement and the role that each citizen plays in maintaining the security of their neighborhoods. We strongly encourage individuals to be vigilant and promptly report any suspicious activity to the authorities. By fostering a culture of active uh, engagement and collaboration between law enforcement and communities, we can create a robust network of support, safeguarding our neighborhoods and reinforcing the bonds that hold us together. In conclusion, I want to emphasize our resolute commitment 
our resolute commitment to taking action. The government heavy investment in 1,800 new police constables demonstrates our determination to address the existing police to population ratio and improve public safety. Coupled with the police wit initiatives, we are dedicated to ensure to ensuring a safer and more secure environment for all. I extend my deepest gratitude to your attention and your support as we work together to build a future that is secure and prosperous for ourselves, our families, and our communities. Thank you. Questions?